what up everybody it's your boy Frenchie and today we got another reaction video today we are reacting to something a little bit different than we normally do react um, today we're reacting to the YouTube new guidelines that it has for the new partnerships and for the smaller channels pretty much this is all it's about um, I want you guys to go down smash that like button subscribe if you're new turn on post notifications because you guys help me grow and you know what since I'm a smaller content youtuber I got to meet the guidelines too just like everybody else out there that's stressing I'm not stressing because I got to keep creating content for you guys so I'm just gonna keep pumping out it's not gonna change anything you know what I mean yeah sure I got to get 1,000 subscribers already at 5k so you know what big ups to me but 40 no 4,000 hours of actual watch time I'm at 2,500, so I'm not far off. I'm not going to complain like all the other people. You know what? It is what it is. YouTube creates these guidelines for people just so they don't let anybody in to make money, get one viral video, make $800, and that's it, right? So we're all out here trying to make money. That's why we're all here. But you got to grind. You got to shine. You know what I mean? Like for me, you know what? It's not about the money. I haven't even, I've made $22 or something since I've joined YouTube. So it's not about the money. It is not. So I'm just trying to get to that goal because I feel like YouTube, once I hit the the goal, I might get more views. I don't know. I had a video hit 30,000. So it's not about any of the statistics or anything like that. But let's not further ado. Let's just get right into this. So I'm going to pull it up on Twitter over here. Additional changes to the YouTube Partner Program, YPP, to better protect creators. 2017 marked a tough year for many of you with several issues affecting the community and the revenue earned from advertising through the YPP. Despite these issues, more than 40% of YouTubers are making six figures. So that's 40% of the YouTubers are actually making six figures. Uh, I'm not going to get into like all of this. I'm just going to get to the main parts. Back in the day, all it took was 10K. As you guys can see right here, all it took was 10,000 viewers. Lifetime. That wasn't much. Lifetime viewers, you only needed 10K views. Now, you need uh, 4,000 hours of watch time in the past 12 months and 1,000 subscribers. A lot of people are complaining right now to the fact that, yeah, they hit the 10K. Now YouTube decides to change change it on them and they won't be making it because 10K. But when you think of it, if you're trying to make money off of 10K views, you're making nothing. Like, you're making nothing. So I don't know what all the fuss is. People are like, you know what? I've hit over 30,000 views on one video. I made no money for it because I wasn't in the partnership. So I'm not even stressing about that. But people complain that, you know, they accumulated all this. They don't got the subscribers. They don't got the watch hours. So what money are you really making? You're not making much. How YouTube views it is how they want to put the guidelines. So you just got to grind a little harder than the other person. Um, it's just the end of the day. It's just everybody has to grind more. That's all it's trying to teach you is, yeah, you're getting the views. You 10K lifetime is nothing. If you were struggling to get 10K then, you're not going to make it. But if you get the 4,000 hours plus the 1,000 subscribers, your channel is actually looking a lot better because when you really think of it to get 4,000 hours of actual YouTube watch time, that's 240,000 minutes, 240,000 minutes. Start busting out the video, start, but you might get a viral video. You guys never know. That's why I keep grinding. So I'm going to keep shining. Shout out to Mojo Jojo back there. Um, yo, it's the year for grinding. No need to complain. Let's keep going on. Let's try to pick out, you know, the best part to this, try to, you know, just get people understanding. Um, it allows for a 30 day grace period. You know what? It's on February 20th, 2018. That's when they're going to cut everybody off. If you're not there, you got to reset, you got to resubmit your application. If you don't got 12, uh, sorry, 4,000 hours and 1,000 subscribers in the past year, you're done. You're just going to get booted off from monetization. And that's the end of it till you actually hit that in a year. To hit that in a year, like, it's not hard. If you want to even be a decent YouTuber and 240,000 minutes of watch time, some people get 240,000 views. 
Imagine just one person of that just watching a video for one minute. That's all they need to do a whole year if they really wanted to keep their monetization. So it's not much. Let's keep it going. Though these changes will uh, affect a significant number of channels. 90% of those who are affected making uh, less than $100 in the last year with 90% earnings less than 250 in the last month. So you, you will get paid for whatever you did um, depending on AdSense how much it lets you take out. So if you haven't made a hundred bucks for Canada, you're not getting that money anyways. Um, it's just, YouTube is just trying to better off their community with trying to make it the best for the people that are on it. They're not just trying to let anybody in, make a viral video, steal, let me say, I can steal your video, post it, YouTube doesn't realize, I get a million views, I get money. That's just how it works, right? So they're just trying to better themselves. Um, that's pretty much the end of the video. If you guys watch to the end, smash that like button because every time you guys smash that like button, it helps me, uh, helps motivate me. Uh, subscribe if you're new. Please turn on post notifications. We're trying to hit a goal of hitting 100K with the new YouTube guidelines. I'm just trying to get the 4,000 hours. I don't even care about the money. Just the 4,000 hours so I can actually be a partner with YouTube. I was before, but now that they changed it, I'm not going to cry over spilt milk. Um, it's just the way I am. It's just making me actually grind harder. That's why I'm doing this video today for you guys. Uh, that is it. Roll the outro.